Just hate hiding all the time. Feeling like everybody's whispering about me. Is that her? My mama says her whole family are Satanists. I like you. You don't know anything about me. My family's different. You a witch. We prefer the term caster. When I turn 16, my powers will be claimed for either the light or the dark. You think you can keep Lena so good, so innocent? Wasn't I the same before I was claimed? And look at what I am now. I don't know what I'll be. I have 75 days left, Ethan. So I'm Jill Slattery with Hi. Zimbio.com. I'm here with Alice Englert and Alden Aaron Reich. Did oh, I get that right? That Yay. <laughs> Who star in the new movie Beautiful Creatures. So you guys have really awesome chemistry in the film. Um, how did you develop that chemistry? Did you do any bonding behind the scenes or was it instant? Um, well, <laughs> no bonding. No bonding. <laughs> we just sort of read the lines and looked at each other. We, um, well, yeah. <laughs> I think we, I think, you know, I, we got along oh, really missing. well from the first time we met because I think we both, um, both had a very similar uh, point of view on what we wanted the film to be and what we want, we wanted to bring a little weirdness to it and have it be something that was, had wit to it and humor and, mm. um, and says something, you know, so I feel like we both were on the same page in terms of that. And that created a mutual respect that then allowed us to just be very playful and fun and relaxed around each other yeah. when we filmed the scenes. <laughs> <laughs> running out of breath. <laughs> <laughs> we watched a lot of Columbo. That is we watched a lot of Columbo. A lot of Columbo. Yeah. Of Columbo. Yeah. Lot of Columbo. Uh, yeah. I turned Peter her Falk. on to Columbo. Ah, yeah. is that an old favorite of yours? New favorite. New <laughs> Remember yeah. when babies? Like, <laughs> right, I was gonna favorite. say, I mean, it's, yeah, uh, you weren't even alive. Day, it's amazing. Uh -huh. it it's such a good show. How'd you even get started watching Columbo? Netflix. Netflix. Ah. I love Peter Falk from the movies that he's in, from like the Cassavetes movies and stuff. And so I was like, I wonder what he's like on this show, and he's. Oh, so good. It's my mom's favorite show. Is it really? Oh, yeah. Is it really? I love your yeah. mom. Yeah. I don't <laughs> know about your mom. Well, I don't know about <laughs> your but I She's will great. extend. I'm sure I do. Yeah. You would. Yeah, you would. It's, uh, nice. it's so good. It's so good. <laughs> you got to work with all these amazing, like, serious actors who've been nominated yeah. with Academy Award for Academy Awards and things like that. I'm wondering if anybody was, like, secretly a prankster or a jokester. The, the only thing I could say is that Jeremy is more Jeremy Irons than Jeremy, than he is himself. Like, then, <laughs> you, you know, you often create an idea of what you think someone's going to be like based on their films, and then you meet them mm -hmm. and they go, hey, they're a normal human being. But when you meet Jeremy Irons, you go, whoa. <laughs> yeah. He's like Jeremy Irons. Right. Yeah. <laughs> he yeah. had this saddle bag that uh -huh. he would take around with a bag. And, <laughs> um, and he would always wear these avia. I can't, yeah, just stop me. <laughs> stop <laughs> Emma me Thompson, now. too. Is oh, they, they all are, very, to be honest. Very, very funny. Well, she started uh -huh. in comedy. Yeah. Like, she was in a sketch comedy group with Hugh Laurie and Stephen mm -hmm. Fry. And so she's like... And I think you see that in the movie. She's so able to to do these different characters with with such ease, you yeah. know, that she she's really very funny and very entertaining. To I have with. to say as well, Viola is sort of someone who I kind of fell in love with mm -hmm. on that film. She has such elegance and grace mm -hmm. and just the ability to be still and not you know, like I kept wanting to please her and make her like me and she just didn't care. <laughs> I, just, I just never knew. I was like, well, all right, I'll just, I'll just like stand near you <laughs> and, and give up. <laughs> but but I, I, that's what I love about her is just that she is real. She's a real mm -hmm. human being and mm -hmm. she's so good. She's amazing. Yeah. yeah. When you're around, with all these actors, yeah. like when you're around any of them, the, just the presence and the power that they have in and of themselves. And they were all, they're all so different, actually, in particular. They really are. <laughs> yeah, they really are. 
So I'm curious, the movie's all about magic casters, and what what magical power would you most want to have, if you could have any? I just feel like this is too much for us now. <laughs> <laughs> we've, sorry, it's just that there's a whole history of what we've now We've gone started. through a lot of different Once. answers. Uh -huh. Okay, now, right this second. Right this second? You have to pick second? one magical power. Okay, right this second. <laughs> to move the patterns on carpets. To move the, to, yeah, to, move the to make, make them like I can control. That'd be scary to me. That would be great. Scary. To do that. Um, uh, I just for this interview to really you know, go well and. <laughs> well, thank just, you. <laughs> yeah, to just, just you know, I don't know. I've been saying that I really like eating fruit, and I always feel like I there's never enough, and so like Endless a bottomless fruit, fruit bowl. Because all like the big, that. all the big magical powers always end up. You always end up like having a problem, or it gets complicated, or your family doesn't like you because you're <laughs> invisible, or whatever it is. You know.